You know something I love? I love to every week, after you know the week reset of PvP on Sunday, come here to the podium, or whatever this is, and check what were the top three teams. And every week I get very unimpressed because every week is this team. <laughs> I mean, it's the most consistent team in the game. What can you do about it? You know, the, the, it, it, the top players are not going to stop using this team every week because it's just the best. What can you do? But some heroes from the top three podium like to end their last match with a troll team so that the people who come to the podium look at the team like, what the hell is this? And that is definitely the case for number two. He's using... Ludovic Merlin is a good team. Do not get me wrong. Ludo with Mer they work phenomenal. But this Ludo has attack gear, which is really weird. And he's putting 11 in the back and Athena in the front. This is not a meant to be team. And whoever I can't read in Japanese, this person is. I am up for your challenge. I am copying your team and trying it out. Now. I have a confession to make to you guys. This is not the first time I'm recording this video. The reason for it is that actually I recorded this full video, you know, 20 minute video. And I realized I was recording the wrong file format for my new quality of video. This video is in 1440p. I got a 1440p monitor. I actually am pretty excited to actually show my, my, uh, my setup once it's done. Because now I have three monitors and it's super extra. Uh, I got a 1440p monitor, so now I can record in 1440p without upscaling. So the video should look better. The only thing that doesn't sound great is my audio, because I still have a lot of echo. Again, my setup is not done. I'm still waiting. You know those YouTuber foam things they put every YouTuber has on their wall? I, I need to put those. I'm still waiting for them to arrive. And I'm going to put like a shelf behind me, like a display to put my anime figures, so when I use a webcam, it's gonna look cool. And of course, I got LEDs and stuff, but that doesn't help with... <laughs> you know, the, the shelf and stuff actually helps with echo. But, you know, LED strips and stuff doesn't actually do it. I also got lighting. I got LED lighting which with RGB uh, because I can put, you know, the light on my face so the camera looks better, but also I can change the color of it. Anyways, enough of my personal life. Let's use... The team um again i have played i played like 10 matches not gonna lie you know the the, the reason why my percentage is so low is because it was already low because i was looking for ban teams the other day with kusak the team isn't the worst actually it's not great just because athena lacks um tanking like actually let me take a look real quick on her defense related stats 47% crew resistance is not great. The almost 70% resistance is actually not bad, though. So her tanking is always... If she takes a crit, she's gonna hurt. But if she doesn't, it's actually not bad. Um, so, <laughs> this is a troll team. This is not meant to be, right? This is not a team that's meant to be. If you were any serious, you would not use Athena in the front. Not because she's bad, because... No, she's bad. In the front, she's bad. Like, her cards are not great. Um, but Athena herself is actually not a bad unit. So, what we're facing here is a classic case of I'm about to destroy you and your whole career. Oh, wait, man. I, I, this is a real player, so it's a little laggy. I'm about to destroy you unless you have dodge food. The reason why I'm risking with the single target first is because of Kusak. Nice. She's dead. See, and this is why I'm saying that actually, low-key, Ludo with Goddess... Not Goddess. Ludo with <laughs> Merlin is a great combo. Oh, I was actually expecting Asterosa in the back. Because he has Kusak and Chan in the... Not Kusak, Chandler, Chandler. He has Chandler and, and Tarma in the front. That would actually be a great option to use him, but that's fine, I guess. Okay, he put up a counter, he disables Merlin. That's not great, but he already takes off my ultimate gauge. You know what? Because you already took off my ultimate gauge, I'm gonna go for this. 
And let's combine cards with you, because I don't want to attack with... Uh... So, <laughs> like I said, I already recorded this video. This, So, you know... Um, I already kind of know Athena and how much damage she can do. She can't do that much damage. Athena is a struggle. Okay, he, had, he got another take off ultimate gauge. That's unfortunate. Athena is a struggle to say the least when it comes to damage. So, this is why I'm saying that this is a troll team. Because there's no way in hell this person unironically thought this team was going to be good for top 100. So, we're going to go for this. Try to kill... Who's, oh, Chandler, I mean... Should have attacked with single target first, but that's okay. I wouldn't have killed anyways. So, the story goes, you know, in my previous recording, which I can't even salvage to edit in this video because the file is completely corrupted. Um, I had a match that I lost in the video because she just wasn't doing enough damage. Like, like Chandler had... Yeah, another take off ultimate gauge, are you kidding me? I actually, I'm actually gonna lose. Chandler had, like, this amount of health that he has right now, right? This amount of, like, legitimately, like, this amount of health. And a level 2 card was not enough to kill him. That is just absolutely disgusting. And he didn't have, like, like, right now, I'm not so confident in killing him because of the damage reduction, but he didn't have any damage reduction. <laughs> it was just raw. Okay. A Tarmi, I was gonna ult. I should still be okay when it comes to Merlin, because she can't just die like that. But I am very concerned because he has. No, I took off. Forgot about Athena for a second. I literally, for a millisecond, I forgot about Athena. She takes off the ultimate gauge when you kill someone. Actually came in clutch, Athena. That is crazy. All right. But again, the, the effect works in the back, so you don't have to use her in the front. Okay, so you might actually hear for a millisecond, I'm opening a can. It's, it's a monster can, don't judge me. Don't judge me, I like my caffeine, okay? Um, man. I, I, uh, I actually went like two weeks without drinking any caffeine at all. And I didn't even really feel any like headaches or anything. That was, maybe I should cut caffeine. But honestly, I just like it too much. I just like it too much to cut it. It's not even like addiction. Because again, I went two weeks and I didn't feel any effects at all. I definitely have somewhat of an addiction though. But it's not even the addiction that's like, it's like, oh, maybe I, I, need, I need my monster. It's like, it just tastes good, you know? And I much prefer, taste-wise, oh, that is unfortunate that you didn't crit, drink a... Monster can been drinking like coke for example. Not that coke tastes bad. I think coke tastes okay But I don't know they it, they just taste better and they have no sugar Anyways enough of my promotion. I would love to be sponsored by a energy drink it, like not even monster is my favorite but by far but if other brands would hit me up and they taste good you know if they give me like a sample or maybe I'll just go out and buy one Try it. I would, I would legitimately take it. Kind of want to stun Ban, but I also kind of want to stun Gopher. Let's make sure that she's dead. This stun only lasts one turn, unfortunately, but that's okay. I was actually hoping he had more cards than that. That is so many Margaret cards he had. Not even Ban. Okay, they lost ultimate gauge. Now, ooh, green golfer doesn't work anymore. That's good. But I still have a glaring issue. Bon is still active. And, I mean, he doesn't have any HP buffers, so I'm actually not very scared. Still hit kind of hard. It might kill Fina. No, it didn't. Can I kill Bon with Ludo here? So I'm gonna... Man, I can't heal because of the Merlin. That is very unfortunate that he got that card for her. We're gonna go for this. And hope that it kills. Might not kill. I... Am potentially dead here. Honestly, if not for the fact 
that he sealed me with Merlin, I would have been okay because I would have healed a good amount. But the the ceiling and me not having Margaret to cleanse, because right here, you know what would have been a much better, so, you know what would have been a much better team right now, for me, is instead of Athena in the front, I had Margaret. Oh, but then I can't use Ludo. <laughs> Forgot about that. Okay. We're not out there yet. We're not out of the game yet. If Eleven can kill Bon here, we could still win. Merlin is one alt gauge away from getting the alt, though. Ah, uh, what is the level 3? No! I, I lost, I lost. Single target level 3, are you kidding me? Oh. Honestly, what, what's what's her ult level? Not even 6-6. Six, six. If not for this level 3 that he got for free here, I actually would have won if 11. But he's gonna kill me with the ultimate, of course. I actually would have won if 11 here. 11 would have been a comeback. Legitimately. But that level 3 took me out of 62k. If, if if he didn't... Nah, I think even a level 2 would have actually been enough to kill me. Type really cocked me there. Honestly, it's, it's, this is not a real team, right? The person who put this in the second place, this is not a real team. Athena... It, like, I would believe this, you know? But Athena is so bad. She's so bad in the front. Her passive is great, as we saw with the Tarmiel, you know, killing someone and then taking off their ultimate gauge, the ultimate gauge of the other characters, is actually a phenomenal passive. And she's a really good unit for the fourth slot. But in the front, her cards suck. There's a reason why no one uses Blue Arthur. You know, Blue Arthur, theoretically, should be a good unit. I actually don't know who to go for here. I think I'm gonna go for Athena. Not Athena. I think I'm gonna go for Margaret. Theoretically, Blue Arthur should be a good PvP unit because he has attack ceiling, which is great, right? And oh man, if I had got a crit, I would have actually killed Margaret. And and he does hit somewhat hard, but that card with the level three need needed to stun is so bad, and that's what she has. She needs a level three to stun. So if you don't have Guffer, it's like, you're barely ever going to see it. Okay, we can easily kill Margaret next turn, so that's good. Then we have to do with the one. It's very unfortunate that we did not get any Merlin cards here, because it would have been a great... Oh, it wouldn't be the free ultimate, because he's definitely going to he's definitely gonna take off my ultimate gauge here, right? Okay, I wouldn't have got the ultimate, but it would have been great for guaranteeing the kill on um, Margaret here. Can I trust? I think I can trust, but in any case, after that, the, the attack is going to still be targeted to Margaret. Okay, she did kill. Again, I, I, I'm, I'm in a big struggle to really trust Athena, because I had a bad experience before in my first recording. Fun! Weird champ. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Not good, because, you know, my DPS is green. And I feel that I wouldn't consider it to be DPS. Um, who is he going for? Ludo? Merlin. If he ki can he kill Merlin? He can't kill Merlin, can he? I don't think he can. I think her passive will stop it. Nice. I don't even know if it was her passive where he didn't do enough damage, but nice. Hmm. I can go for getting Ludo's ultimate as well here, and I'm hoping that these green attacks will be enough to kill him. He has damage reduction though. If he didn't have damage reduction, I actually might have killed him. Maybe, I don't know. I'm not 100 on that. The Bon card is gonna kill Merlin though, so that's not good. And he is immune, so he can heal with Ascanor. The one good thing is, he doesn't have any HP buffers. 
But we saw last match that it didn't matter, the bond still hit pretty hard. But he doesn't have any increased damage. Ooh. <laughs> Level 3? Okay. The one good thing is that he did not heal a single bit from that. But he didn't have... He had, had not take that much damage anyways. So Ludo... Theoretically, should kill Askenor and Gringelfer with this, and that will take off because I have a Fina Bond's ultimate. Nice. In usual, you know, terms, he would get the ultimate here, but we have a Fina, so should lose two ultimate, four ultimate gauge, right? Because we killed two characters. No, it only works once. That's I didn't know that, actually. I thought maybe he would lose 4, but that's okay. How much is he gonna heal from that? 4k, 7k, okay. It's a struggle. This is not a team I recommend you guys trying. I mean, you know, it requires two collab characters, so a lot of you probably maybe skipped on, maybe, you know, getting Athena up and stuff like that. Um, if you summon for them anyways. But I would not recommend this team. This team is a troll team. And, but I, I, I took it on the chin and tried. Alright, that's it. Thank you guys for watching.